Okay, hi, this is Tasha, the Crafty Crowd. I wanted to do a quick review today on um, my Polar FT7. Um, I'm really into working out and I love my watch. Um, I actually have Humana Healthcare and um, they have a program where if you work out for 30 minutes and your heart rate um, is over whatever the qualifications are, mine's I think 106, if, if I keep my heart rate over 106, um, for 30 minutes I get points and when you build up the points you get credits or you can get gift cards or you can buy products and stuff so anyway so I keep track of my uh, my heart rate monitor and then I upload it to my Humana site and get credit for that but this review is actually about the FT7 and the problem that I've had I've had this problem and I've read that a lot of people have actually had this problem where the uh, your heart rate when it shows let's see if I can do this real quick when you start it and you start your heart rate, mine would start either as um, zero, it would show zero, zero instead of the heart rate. You see right here it says 90, 94. Um, it would come up as zero, zero, or it would start fine and then it would get an error reading and um, show, you know, zero, zero in the middle of my workout and it would go off for a couple minutes and it, it, it just wouldn't keep a reading. So. I read some reviews and people said you got to make sure it's wet and it's the connections and all this other crazy stuff. So what I figured out was actually it comes with a strap with the heart rate um, transmitter, right? So your heart rate transmitter, you have to keep it wet. So of course you want to make sure it's nice and wet when you put it on. Um, when you're done working out, you want to detach this part and make sure it's dry, this part here. So you want to make sure it's dry. Um, when you store it and you want to kind of rinse off the band um, every once in a while. But what I, problem I was having is this band, even though it was the smallest one, would still slip or it wasn't very tight on me. And I think that's actually what was causing the problem. Because what I did, and I had actually done this a while back, was I, um, I took this apart, this band apart here, See if you can see it better here. So this part right here, where you can make it looser and tighter, that little metal part, I took that apart and I made the loop so that so I can make this part tighter so it would fit me snugger. But that still didn't work. So I said, well, let me just try this temporarily. So I actually folded it over here and I just did a couple stitches on each side so it wouldn't open up so now it's a lot tighter so now it's really really tight when it's on me and I haven't had one problem with the heart rate reading since I've done that so it's very 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 snug you got to make sure it's tight um, if it if it lo if it's at all loose I guess it loses a connection I'm not a big sweater anyways but I, I mean it's always you always want to make sure it's wet but once it loses that little, you know, if you move a certain way and you're, you know, it just, it just loses a, it loses a connection. So if you're having problems with your heart rate reading zero during your workout, it'll show a normal heart rate and then it'll come up zero and it's hard to get it started. Try making sure that your strap is tighter. Even if you have to safety pin it, if you have to sew it, whatever, you want to make sure this is very, very, very tight on your body and you want to make sure it's up as kind of like if you wear a sports bra for your woman mine goes right underneath my sports bra so you want to make sure that it's kind of right in this area right here kind of by your by your ribs right up here so you make sure it's nice and tight right there um, other than that this is an awesome watch I love it I've had it for uh, going on a year this summer will be a year and I really, really enjoy it. It keeps you motivated because you can see um, how many calories and everything that you're burning. Um, that was my only issue though, was, uh, was the heart rate readings coming up zero and it would be really, really frustrating, especially when you're working out and you know your heart rate is like sky high and it's not giving you credit for it. So it would drive me crazy. But anyways, hope this helps, even if it helps one person. Uh, like, like Again, like I said, I've read a lot of reviews where people say that it's the these little connectors here that it's those or this and i clean those and you know i really make sure it's dry and everything but that wasn't my problem at all um, it was really the the connect the how tight it was on your body so you want to make sure that 
that it's really, really nice and snug. And it went, you need to have it a direct contact on your body, not through any clothing. All right, well, thanks for watching. I hope this helps.